Hi friends, I am from erasdev.com. Today I am here to explain you how to read the HTML file through Java program. So first we will create our HTML file. So I have opened this notepad and I have created here HTML file. So here I have opened this HTML tag. Then I have opened this head tag. Then I have opened title tag and here I am giving page title. And here I am closing this title. Then I have closed this head tag and then I have opened this body tag and inside that body tag I am giving this I am opening this header tag and I am giving this is Suvia info here and here I am closing this header tag. Then I have opened paragraph tag and here I am giving our website name is errorcraft.com and now I am here closing this paragraph tag and then I have closed this body tag then I have closed HTML tag. So this is my information which I am going to show you through Java program. How we can read the file through Java program. So before that I will show you through HTML page how we are getting this information. So first I will save this file. So in D drive I am saving this file with name readfile.html. So here I will save this file and first I will show you through HTML page. So I will go in D drive and this is my file name readfile.html. So first I will run this to get the information of this file. So here we got this information through this HTML page. This is Surya Info where our website name is errorcrack.com. So this is our information which we have given in the HTML file. So now I am going to show you this information through Java program, how it works. So first I will open this Eclipse. So I have opened this Eclipse and in this program we have used try and catch block also. So if any exception will be there then this catch block will catch this exception and give output as exception. So first we will debug this program to show you line by line how it is working. So first I will debug this and by pressing F6 we will go in next line and we will show you how it is working line by line. So here I have used a string builder HTML, so this object, HTML object I have created of string builder and here I am giving new string builder. So this new uh, string builder class will uh, cre create empty capacity for this HTML file which is of a string type. And in next line here I have given this object of file reader and I am here I am giving new file reader and here I have given this file path name. So this file reader will read this uh, path name and uh, it will uh, check this file name. So it will read this file name and next it will go in next line and here I have created this object of buffer reader. So this buffer reader uh, is equal to new buffer reader. So this buffer reader class it will read characters of the file name. And in next line here I have given this loop. Before this loop here I have created value which is of string type. So in this file when buffer reader will read the characters of the file then it will it will assign to this value which is of string type. So uh, uh, after that I it will go inside this while loop. So inside that loop here I have given value is equal to br dot read line is not null. So this value will read that buffer, this buffer reader will read that file until it will get null. So until it will get null it will read that characters of that file and after that here after reading that HTML file it will append to that value. So until it will get null it will append all the characters of that file. So now it will go inside that loop 
until it will get null so it is it is appending the characters of that file so once it will get null it will go inside this br.close so here i am closing this buffer reader so after getting this null it will go in this clo close file and in next here here i have created this result uh, which is of a string type and here i have given html dot two string so this through this two string method it will read the it will get the html uh, file information and it will get into this wizard which is of a string type and in next line here through this system dot out dot print i am printing this wizard of that html file so now i will close this uh, debugging and will show you the output of this program now i will execute this program and now we got this output so this is the output of this program so in uh, this html file we have given this information which we got output in uh, through this java program so this is our output of this program to read this html file thank you friends hope you like this video please like share comment and if you will have any query please leave in the comment box so that we will get back to you thank you friends